this is a Bell Iroquois UH-1 helicopter. This is in Army, Australian Army livery. Although, uh, for a goodly proportion of their time in Australian military service, they were uh, flown by the RAAF by, from memory, five and nine squadrons. And of course, the OX-1 was uh, the standard support airlift gunship for the RAAF and latterly for the Australian Army. Aviation Corps in the 70s, 80s and early 90s. And uh, in my own experience, when I was serving with SUR, I took two flights in one of these buggers. And I remember sitting right down there on the floor space of the Huey. And uh, even though I'm usually shit scared of flying, it was actually good fun. And over here we got a Kiowa. Or Kiowa. Looking here now at the nose of a government air factory's nomad. I suppose if you want to be strict about it. This is the last Australian military aircraft designed and built here in Australia. I believe from memory they had a fairly average reputation. There we go, there's the Kiowa. Now over here, and excuse the light as we go past the opening of the hangar, there's a CAC boomerang. I think this is a CAC 12. Australia's first designed and developed and built fighter aircraft based on the Wirraway, which was in turn based on the North American trainer, known by the Brits as the Harvard. Unfortunately, the boomerang never actually shot down any aircraft during World War II, but uh, in service was used in the ground attack role. Had fantastic rate of climb, good manoeuvrability but uh, in the long run was supplanted by aircraft supplied by the Allies such as uh, Kitty Hawks, Spitfires and uh, latterly Mustangs. And uh, just over here we have a PC-9 Pilatus Porter which uh, was also a standard Army Aviation Corps piece of kit for a goodly portion of the 70s, 80s and early 90s. And of course I've said PC-9 when it's actually PC-6. Don't trust anything I say. There's a CAC wing shield which uh, supplanted the uh, Wirraway and uh, was in turn replaced by the CT4 from memory. There you go, there's a bit of footage from the Australian Army Aviation Museum here at Oakey.